this machine doesn't give heat to the building so let's check it out and find out what's going on right now it's off inside so let's see what's happening should be off inside I know the disconnects off My only complaint about this design of a unit, I wish there was a door on the top. So there's separate sections, the gas and the blower. Unfortunately, they're all mixed together. So let's turn this on. See what happens. They don't give me a lot of space for me to hang out. Put me right in front of the exhaust. So I can know what the trouble is shoot. like right in front of me the pitch pockets kind of in the way we fired still sparking out all right Let's see what's going on I don't think it's the wind because it's really not windy out here, so. Dum, dum, dum. Let's see what happens when it tries again. Sparks for a long time, I'm noticing. Still sparking. Ow. Again. Okay. Let's check the flame sensor. I'm sure the third time it's going to do exactly the same as it did the previous tries. It's still sparking. my flame current is I might have to reset it and I am on the wrong spot Boom. let's see let's see, yeah. let's see what we get oh we got a blink so we got one, two, one, two, and I'm almost positive that's gonna be a flame failure. Let's turn this off. Okay. Let everything stop. Turn it back on. Too bad I can't sit. Can I? Is it strong enough? Oh, it is. All right. So let's see what we get. Sure, nothing here is touching metal. Probably just a dirty flame sensor. We've lit nothing. I go to the other side. Oop, let's see that again. I think I am getting something. Let me get my regular meter out. only has one setting <laughs> uh, 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 uh. I'll borrow the lead test leads from this one after this little fire let's see what happens we lit nothing okay 
Now, back to the old reliable, even though this is old, but I don't know how reliable it is. This is my go-to for everything. This doesn't lie. This always, always tells me the truth. So. We're still blinking solid, so. No flame current. I either, I think I have a bad board. And I'm not even getting anything. Zero. Let's see when I pull that little flame sensor out, what happens? My bag is a mess. Oh, I hate when it gets like this. Too much work. That's what it means when my bag gets like this. Because my nut driver's missing. Now the nut driver's my long quarter inch. Oh well. It's fine. I got a six in one even though I wish I had it. What are you going to do? Sometimes you just got to do what you gotta do. Six and one's work. Let's see. What's the condition of this thing? Doesn't look bad at all. Actually looks pretty good so I don't think this is the problem I could wipe it off real fast but still don't think this is the problem I gotta check that wire to ground see if something's bleeding off the ground there This looks pretty good, even the base. Is there any cracks in the flame sensor on the porcelain? Not really seeing anything. Sometimes this could be dirty. It's not though, doesn't make good contact. Looks like somebody may have scraped it too, so. I usually have my maintenance is scrape these off, so that should be good. What does the wire look like? <sighs> it doesn't look like it's not connected. It looks pretty connected to me. So here to here. Wait a second. I got some greenish color almost on that. A little bit of blue corrosion. I don't know if you guys can see that's around this. Hmm. Let's see. Let's test this wire though. Both sides. Wire test good. Put that there. All right. Test lead. Let's go to ground. See if we're bleeding out the ground. No, good. Wire is not bleeding to ground. Okay. Because I'm not producing any micro amps. I'm thinking it's most likely the board, especially the way this flame sensor looks. Unless the flame sensor itself is grounded. So let's see, is the rod grounded? Bleeding to ground, no. Okay. Yep, rod is good, not going to ground. 
So, oh, wait, what did I just get? Nope, nothing. Still zero, so. All right. I'm going to grab a board for my truck. See what happens. All right, so. I should have grabbed the nut driver roll so while I was down there. wet I think which is why this old board doesn't appear to be working correctly I believe something got wet on it motor boom boom igniter screw looks decent not like it would be causing a problem because these are the grounds for the board Come with the new screws, screwgins. Screwgins are always friggin' missing. Oh well, just quick little wipe off. Should be fine. I mean, as I drill it in and out. Well, yep, let go. Dun, dun, dun. Mm -mm -mm. Quick little wipe. I'm thinking there's something wrong with the board. It's not producing any milliamps and microamps, milliamps, whatever. Flame current, whatever you want to call it. It's just not being produced. And that should go easily by hand. Not the board's not in the right spot, or the screw's not lined up correctly. Mm -mm -mm. Let's see. Okay, I just don't want to send it in with a drill to find out that I put it in the wrong spot. I'm missing one. <laughs> ah, it's on the drill still. All right, so let's just ship it. Ship it home. If you use a drill, be careful. Don't break your board. Almost like that hole's a little stripped.
things back on on the flame sensor so let's test the flame sensor out see how this is and the igniter I gotta still put on all right so I forgot something okay here we go let's turn it on well not gonna do anything if this isn't connected okay need to make a spark Come on, you know you want to light and stay lit. You want to produce milliamps. Where's the old board? Where did I put it? There we go. Ah, uh, there you go. There you go. We got flame current. Just what the doctor ordered. A little flame current. Look. It's got greenish stuff on it. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> forgot the blower was about to kick on. A good little startle is always freaking good. I was looking at the board, I forgot about everything, but I got some white crust. Gas yeah, off, I killed it. You can see there's some white crust here on this. Maybe a little water spilled on it or something. I don't think that green stuff stopping it from making a connection though. Something on the board. It's trying to spark again. Give it gas. See, I got four six on my meter, so everything is good. Till next time, I'm out. Back control board, not allowing the flame signal. Gotta love it.